Hello, my name is Gregory Harlow. I'm entering my final year here at the University of Oregon as a 2012-2013 Beckman Scholar. So what this means is I will be completing my bachelor's degree in chemistry with a very generous $19,300 grant from the Arnold and Mabel Beckman Foundation to support my research project. I spend a majority of my time in the lab with Professor Shi Wan Lu that focuses specifically on the development of 1,2 azeborans, which are nitrogen boron containing ring systems that are mimics of ubiquitous benzene. Now, my proposed research project involves the association of the 1,2 azeborian framework to polyols, molecules that contain multiple oxygen-hydrogen groups. So the big picture idea for this project involves the strategic coordination of selective polyols to the 1,2 azeborian framework. And these complexes that are formed may exhibit unique optoelectronic properties. In other words, how these molecules absorb and re-emit light. And this may prove to have potential application in material science research. If you look at the structure of a sugar molecule, such as glucose, you'll find that there are multiple oxygen-hydrogen groups projecting out from the molecule. So naturally, it would be an extension of this research project to attempt to associate the 1,2 azeborian framework to sugars. And then these complexes could be studied for potential application in the biological sciences. So previously, I'd seen myself pursuing a career in retail pharmacy, which would have been a continuation of over four years of retail experience that I used to at least partially support my way through college. But it was early last year when I had the simultaneous experience of enrolling in Professor Liu's organic chemistry class, as well as serving as a peer tutor for the first time for Professor Mark Carrier's biology course. I really began to question this individual I'd seen myself becoming in 20 or 30 years. Well over a year later, I can tell you without any question that my enthusiasm on a day-to-day -day basis only continues to grow. And I owe so much respect for both Professor Liu and Professor Carrier for believing in me by providing the necessary opportunities and freedoms to allow myself to realize the individual I now aspire to become. Thank you.